On today's video, we're gonna show you how to make homemade Philly cheesesteaks. And you're not gonna to wanna to miss this. Let's get to cooking. All right, so before we get this thing started, let's go ahead and get all the Philadelphia cheesesteak fighting out of the way. Uh, I'm using Cheese Whiz. In my opinion, Cheese Whiz tastes a hundred times better than provolone. Maybe because we got shitty provolone in Oklahoma. Very well could be. So I like Cheese Whiz. As far as the rolls, I use a hoagie roll. You can make your own, a lot of people do. I'm too uh, lazy for that, so I just buy them from the store. Uh, pro tip, Jimmy John's day old bread works perfect. As far as the meat, now this ain't that steak and ease. This is actually sliced ribeye. Another pro tip, if you have an Asian market close to you, usually they have sliced ribeye there and it's not extremely overpriced. Uh, we're going down with white onions, green onions, and I'm gonna season it with a little bit of our classic steak rub. So. So I'm gonna go ahead and start warming up my cheese. And I'm just gonna turn this on low. Now technically out of the, uh, out of the jar, this is gonna come out really thick. So I like to thin it. You can thin it with milk, water. Uh, I got a beer sitting right here, so I'll use beer. This takes a little bit to come up, so I'm gonna go ahead and get my onions and bell pepper. Set it right that time, huh? You can use butter if you like. I'm gonna use oil for this one just because I just grabbed it instead of butter. Go ahead and throw a little butter on there. I ain't ever hurt nobody. And now let's get these rolls heating up. Get a little bit of oil on these. These go quick too. Now, I'm gonna season the steak with a little bit of classic steak seasoning. Or a lot. Go ahead and kill the heat on that baby. Split these up equally.
Ooh, get that little toast on that bun. Cheese is looking phenomenal. These are super easy to make and an absolute crowd pleaser. All right, here we go. Oh, come on. Losing it, losing it. going everywhere. Is there at least stuff full of meat? All right, so the thing I love about this sandwich is it's about as authentic as you're gonna get here in Oklahoma. Sliced ribeye, uh, grilled onions, grilled green peppers, hoagie roll, steamed, cheese Whiz. But if you like provolone, you use provolone. I just absolutely love cheese Whiz. So yeah, this is a perfect sandwich for anybody at any time, or if you're just making them by yourself like me. All right, so I'm, I'm trying to figure out where I'm gonna take a bite from, so I'm, I'm just gonna jump right on in. These are absolutely phenomenal. That classic steak rub, you can really taste it in the, both in the uh, vegetables and in the meat, just paired with that cheese whiz. On that fresh hoagie roll, you cannot beat this, man. I promise you. So hey, I wanna thank everybody for watching. If you wanna make this recipe, head on over to CosmosQ.com, turn off the recipe, make it for you and your family, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace. Some days I, I see myself working in the bodega. Dirt.